up you lovely human beings Frank Valkyria welcome to the channel for another episode so where are we at today well it seems like we have to do a little bit of corrections on the video of yesterday but actually more than correction is like a more of a deep dive because new stuff is coming out which honestly I was already suspecting so anyway let's get going before we go how you doing leave a comment let me know it's important the little thing the thing you give for granted actually are the thing that matters the most you breathing you walking did you go outside and have your first croissant did you enjoy your coffee this morning all good all great that's exactly what i did so let's dive into this together apparently new images are coming out of ah with her friends parting in Cabo San Lucas, something like that in Mexico. Those footage are from 2019. So, bam! I told you. I don't know if it's debunked because yesterday those TikTok headlines were saying like, oh, 2000, blah, 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 JD Yacht. I already knew that was false. I was just waiting for the confirmation to come out. I had that suspicion that probably was something afterwards. There was no way that JD would have allowed those people after the divorce to be parting or whatever he owned anymore because leeches. So anyway, this is from one of her friends. I don't know. This is probably was a fun page and the internet keeps a copy and it keeps the receipt. And here we go. Bam. Well, it's <clears throat> sorry. It's obvious that they're still singing the same song, and again, to, this is 2014, her 33rd birthday, Cabo San Lucas, Baya, California, uh, the Sud, Mexico. There is uh, Amber Eo, uh, Corey, Remy, Savannah, Michael, Lucy, Sasha. So all those people. Uh, this was probably a fun page. Just enjoying um, Luna Sea. That's the boat they rented as a fishing boat. So there you have it. These people partying in those in those places. Here we go, right there. Look at them. So what is interesting is that 25 April 2019. What is interesting is that. This obviously really very clearly feels like he's the entourage of age. So it's not a coincidence. So all these people are following her now because she's the one with the cash. And, uh, and that's not a, an assumption. Mas Luna C. All right. I want to say two things. First of all, I'm sorry they're using this boat. And you know why? Because I love their name. Their name Luna C actually used to be one of my favorite Japanese J-Rock band. If you've never heard of Luna C, you're welcome. Now you know where to go. Check Luna C, some of their greatest hits. Great J-Rock band from Japan, of course. So, well, I, I suppose this is also the period uh, either post Elon Musk. Now I don't have the numbers in front of me, but it's actually quite interesting because uh, you, you have a sense, of course, that this could be enough time uh, where they got the money from JD. 2019, I don't know how quickly actually she got the money. Now I forgot. I remember uh, the basically the bookkeeper of the, you know, somebody that managed the money of JD on the trial that he explained that all the money were paid or the divorce settlement and also the outstanding expenses which were shared with JD at the time. And uh, were paid in full. So everything that was open, credit cards, you know, all other expenses surrounding the house and whatnot, were paid in full by JD. So, of course, we don't know how long it took to, uh, to get the uh, 2000... Uh, well, actually, <clears throat> actually, now I start to remember because um, I think between 2018 and 2019, somewhere in between, she pledged the money to the charities... And we know that 
I don't know, a year plus past 50 months, 80 months, whatever. And since she had the money, so probably, probably she got the money somewhere in 2018. Uh, call me out if I'm wrong. But I'm sure she, by now, in this time, probably she had the money from the 7 million settlement. So probably they were kind of having fun. So let's read here. Notice how she's dead center in every picture and in one trying to block Io. Uh, previous YouTube video on this bee gypsy was incorrect about the party on JD Boat. I absolutely agree with you, was incorrect. Now we know it's 2019. But it's interesting to see those people partying, the entourage. Because like I said yesterday, you really got a sense that these people, that absolutely every reason in the book to lie, uh, either by testimony, by fabricating things, uh, because they are still friends with this person. And we also know that they moved on from JD to Elon Musk and to Raj when she started to uh, go out with Elon Musk. So it's very fascinating human dynamics. You see that, um, I give you an example. I'm a loner, right? I have very good friends. Um, especially now that I'm back in Italy, you know, I connect with some friends which we know each other for 20 years, 25 years. Some we have known each other literally since we were three years old. So I have very few, but very good friends. Um, we are not together all the time. We don't go around in entourages. So it's very fascinating to see how some people, you know, display some traits of not being able to be alone. And it's very common also in people like with narcissistic, narcissistic traits, for instance, to be needing always the supply of attention. And to do that, usually you sort of garner around yourself people which they kind of, you know, do the work of, you know, literally petting you, you know, when you need it and, and supporting you. So you have all that kind of emotional support from many many people around you constantly because you can't be alone and uh, it, it's very 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 clear to me that you could have some you know true narcissistic behavior there again actually it's nothing new because out of the words of dr curry we know of these trionic borderline personality narcissistic traits which were diagnosed by a professional so you know you make of that what you want. But when you see these, you also understand that it seems like pretty clear. You go, you go around, you know, with a whole bunch of friends, um, which sometimes can be fun too, but it seems like that those people are literally extensions of AH everywhere she went, literally also from one relationship to the next. We saw also the picture with Elon Musk surrounded by all of these people. So if anything gives a lot of credence to those rumors or those uh, diagnoses of um, of narcissism. So again, probably parting because they got the bum bum in the pocket by now. You know, they didn't pay the children hospital. You know, they they pledged she pledged three million and a half to the children hospital. Literally, kids with cancer. No money, no pecunia, eh? no dinero. Let's go pay for everybody. Cabo San Lucas. Honestly, if I have to tell you the truth, this is pure speculation, of course. But sometimes I cannot help but feel that probably those holidays were paid also by another, by another mesonet. Eh? Maybe the rocket man was supplying a little bit more to this entourage because those people were used to JD, were used to JD generosity, all the money lavishing them with food, wine, houses holidays they never paid for anything and uh, so they're used to basically have everything served on a silver platter and probably they thought you know what why silver when you can have gold and eh, with elon musk maybe so let's upgrade just saying i'm just saying total speculations here this is the video of yesterday of course in connection with this one uh, it's interesting because they're listening to the same song in the car party. They're listening to the same song in the boat, on the boat.
So anyway, this is now we corrected this video. It's 2019, just for our own sake. Um, what do you make of this, right? I personally believe that they were celebrating uh, winning. You know that things worked the way they wanted. They're celebrating that they managed at this point in time to get away with all the lies, the manipulation, the fake pictures, um, throwing JD under the bus, taking everything away from him, his reputation, his job, his work, his money. So keep that in mind. This is the celebration of people, allegedly. Eh? We are speculating here. I'm not saying we are alleging, but it seems that that's what they were celebrating, uh, getting away getting away with lying, getting away by using the Me Too movement, feminism, all those things that actually at the core they should have good causes in mind. Eh? And remember that to cap all of this, this person, she went on TV saying that those seven millions went to the SELU and went to the Children's Hospital, right? And it wasn't true. The money was in the pocket, in the bank, and maybe somebody else was paying for those nice holidays with the entourage. So keep that in mind. Again, we corrected the video of yesterday. Leave a comment, share your thoughts. Please subscribe in mass. You know, the better, the more, the better. Always spread love. Ciao.